Hello! Today I'm going to show you how to create a spectacular grass text effect in Photoshop in a few simple steps. To complete this tutorial, you need to download the tutorial assets from the written version of the tutorial. I am Ivan Gromov for Envato Tats Plus. First of all, we need to create a new document with 1900 by 1200 pixel size. After that, hit G to pick the gradient tool and set the gradient type to radial, and use the following color codes. A, D, B, F, 4, 1. And 3, 2, 8, A, 2, 6. Then create a background using this gradient. Now we need to place the 6th texture and then hit Ctrl U and set the saturation to minus 100. Now set the blending mode to color burn and the opacity to 20%. To get a really distressed look, copy this layer by using Ctrl J case combination and then rotate it to 180 degrees. After it, put some more textures and blend them using color and linear burn blending modes. Duplicate the original background gradient and place it above all the layers. Set the opacity to about 40%. Let's create a new layer over the top. And then create a vignette with a soft black brush. Set the blending mode to overlay and the opacity to 30%. After that, add a Gaussian blur effect with 32 pixel size. Now we are ready to make grass text. Put the grass texture inside the document and make it invisible. Create a text you want to use using the Devon Horgan font. Set the text color to white. And then change the opacity to 50%. Create 4 duplicates of the grass texture with Ctrl J case combination. Now we could start to create the grass texture text effect. Select the pen tool and start selecting the letter. Your path should follow some individual blades of the grass. That way, when you have the final cut out, they will look like pieces of grass sticking out.
right click on the path and select Make Selection. Set the Fever Radius to 0. Select one of the grass layers and then invert your selection using Ctrl Shift I case combination and then press Delete. Now let's add some layer styles. Add bevel and emboss and use the following settings. Depth 100 Size 10 Highlight mode screen with white color and 16% opacity Shadow mode multiply with black color and 25% opacity Then add set an effect with the following settings. Blend mode screen. Color 6, 4, 9, 1, 2, A. Opacity 13. Angle 19. Distance 11. And size 14. And for the last layer style, let's add drop shadow with the following settings. Blend mode normal, opacity 20, angle 176, distance 15, pred 0, and set the size to 20. Control click the grass layer and then on a new layer below fill it with black using Shift F5 case combination. Then move it right and down. Go to Filter, Blur, Motion Blur and set the angle to minus 48 and distance to 45. Set the shadow's opacity to 30%. Duplicate the layer and after that hit Ctrl E. Then set this layer to multiply and the opacity to 60%. Select all letters E layers and group them by using Ctrl G case combination. Let's add more individual blades of the grass to make them look more natural. Select and use the smudge tool. Now you can create the rest of the letters using the same technique. Let's add some more extra text. Pick PT Sans font, set the color code to double B E five seven one. and set the blending mode to overlay and the opacity to 50%. After that, duplicate the text and set it to screen. 
Now let's add two eye-catching elements to offset all the green color. I have used butterfly and ladybug photos from Envato elements. Open the photos in Photoshop. Use the pen tool to trace the images as we did for the letters and after it place them to our main canvas. Resize the elements using Ctrl T as you need. Then we need to add a drop shadow effect to these elements. And here is our final result. Don't forget to share your recreation of this grass text effect with us. We would love to see it. Thank you for watching and don't forget to check our channel for more tutorials.